Play clock at 10. Morgan steps away, puts it out into the flat, complete. And that's uh, Bryce Williams who's tackled down by Montclavian Brinson. Georgia Southern has two safeties, and so the box is there to run the football. And Bryce is the guy as a freshman that really had a breakout season. Run it with Williams. Lowers the shoulder and scores. Bryce Williams, touchdown Minnesota, a two-yard run. By the offensive line, creating some push. You can see them right there where the line of scrimmage was and where it is now. Three yards down the field allows Bryce Williams to get into a gap and lower shoulders for the touchdown. Lower, Joe Milton, they've been hurt by a mobile quarterback so far. Trying to cut off the season against Omolo, who had a sack on the first series. Now on third down and long throwing on the short route to Brian Hightower and Hightower is down and well short of the first down. It's Hunter Morgan 6 of 11, 115 tonight. Here's the first carry for Bryce Williams, redshirt sophomore. Dressed for the Iowa game but did not play. Morgan looking left the entire time, throws, that's caught, that's Williams. Williams diving inside the five. to Wiley, designed rollout, and the pass is complete. It's Bryce Williams out of the backfield. Now they spin Wiley out, and they give it to Williams. Inside the 15 to the 13, just wouldn't go down to pick up a five yards. Giving a little outside move by Daniel Jackson, then getting up the field, and here good tempo from Minnesota. First down and goal at the two, they hand it off, touchdown, goal for Bryce Williams. Middle that's so key setting up the touchdown as Bryce Williams lunges forward for the score. And baseball cap that I have owned for two years but have had no reason to wear for a game, and I'm also wearing my raincoat. It's very wet. Good luck, sir. <laughs> it is Bryce Williams who wears number 40. A scoring drive for Purdue here this year. After the announcement of Bryce Williams now again with the address changing from 21 to 40 and a flag already out on this kickoff. Williams gets the carry. And he crosses midfield. So because you talked about it, six offensive linemen in the game. There's Jumbo, I guess we're going to call it for this afternoon. Williams the carry gets around the right edge and knocked out of bounds. Five yard pickup. Williams again. Busting tackles. Let's see if they throw the fade to Altman Bell. Morgan gives that one to Williams straight ahead. That's a first down. All four of the losses this season by Nebraska have been by one score. Morgan gives to Bryce Williams. With what we just saw on the field, not getting points on the two-inch line and then missing, give me field goals and PATs. Williams, that's enough for a first down. Nebraska looking for their first road victory. Minnesota. Play clock under five as Williams gets to carry. Third and four. Williams, first down. This is the personnel grouping that Minnesota closed out Purdue with. Williams again up the middle. 220. One left in the game. Williams the carry busts the tackle and Williams is loose and he's got a house call as Minnesota is going to try to put this one away. Thanks to Bryce Williams. He's got 115 yards rushing. And Nick Henridge is in position to make the play. But that's what happens. You put a lot of guys on the line of scrimmage, and one guy misses a tackle. The band's playing for the opposition. Williams again. And 
plowing his way, and that's good enough for a first down. Here early on. And now they will go ahead and run that football with Bryce Williams. You mentioned Maryland had the edge, and Co uh, Co Keith took it right away from him. Took Here's it away. Bryce Williams up the middle to the 25. The handoff, weaving through and out across the 40 goes Bryce Williams. And an offensive lineman in at fullback as well. Williams will follow it into the end zone. Touchdown. Well, I saw the, the offensive signal will bring in the big guys. And 65 right there lined up at fullback. He had the great block earlier as a left tackle. First and 10. Bryce Williams. It's a much different football team than we saw that loss to Bowling Green. Oh, nice sidestep in the backfield, and Williams finds his seam. Bryce Williams starts in the backfield and right up the middle. So there you go. That's how they want to start at seven on the ground. Morgan drops it off underneath, but a lot of room and a first down. Bryce Williams. It's the last option for Tanner Morgan. There's good coverage, his first look. You see him there go to his escape. They did not pass off the coverage on the back end. Fans, alums, students, check the boxes. It's been what they wanted. Bryce Williams in the game and running back. Axel Rushmeyer, the offensive lineman, just went off the field after the injury. There's a completed pass to Bryce Williams. They're at the 15, Bryce Williams. Another one of the running backs who suffered an injury last year. But Williams looking strong and tough. He better go watch uh, his head coach. He has to have that out right now because that's one of those plays he's talking about. That's a great. Moving in at quarterback now after Tanner Morgan had played the first three quarters. Bryce Williams runs it. Well, it's the second straight year that Terrell Smith has had an interception in the opener. He had one against Ohio State in game number one last year. And in the fourth quarter of tonight's season opener for the Gophers against New Mexico. It was 4-4 four, four prior to that. Possibly four down territory. Minnesota still trying to get that stink of that early fumble off of them. Third and long here. Morgan over the middle as a completion. Bryce Williams that time. Oh, we got another QB change for Minnesota. Cole Kramer, third quarterback we've seen today. Hands it off. Minnesota bound for a 2-0 start now would be their first 2-0 start since 2019 as you see Williams work his way ahead there he leaves this program he will always remember this day as the first time he got in the end zone on a college football field what a special moment for the Greek gopher the Greek gopher <laughs> trademark that you're, you're, you're trying to find the balance of, all right, head spinning, but I can make a couple plays, so coach has me out there, and this is also what I've always wanted to do my entire life, and that's what Bryce Williams has been his doing his entire life, stiff arming guys, is he? Ibrahim again over 100 yards today. Shocker. 11 straight with 100 yards. Jason, take a look at how many white jerseys it just took. Bryce Williams also in there at tailback. Bryce able to get out to the 39-yard line. Another good run behind Quinn Carroll. Second down and three. First down for Williams. And through the first 45 minutes of this game, Bryce Williams dancing his way through defenders and down to the 30-yard line. Matthew, you remember you used to see guys work out back in the day? They used to have the tires, and you had to put one foot in one tire oh, yeah, and put them yeah. in. Yeah. Watch the run. Tell me this isn't the tire high right knees, here. High knees. Yep. It's high knees. Huge hole up the middle with a nice cut for Bryce Williams. And another rushing touchdown. Minnesota. I know there'll be better days ahead for Isaiah Lewis, number 23, but watch the safety in the middle of the field. You're one-on-one. -on -one. Here comes the back. Here comes you, and 
Left, right, left, right. And Bryce Williams in the game. Saw him catch a pass earlier. This is his first run. Bryce Williams with a hole on the outside. And stepping out right around the first down marker. Bryce Williams staying on his feet. Morgan out of the backfield, Williams. Charges ahead close to the 30-yard line. High snap on the ground, and Williams takes it out across the 40-yard line of the 41. Early in the season, they are now playing zone defense, trying to protect those defensive backs. Yeah, this is where Purdue struggled. End of game, end of half situations. Williams has midfield. He's got a first down. That'll momentarily stop the clock. Minnesota's got a timeout. A lot of fun to watch, but so is this entire offensive line. You can tell their chemistry is great. They played a lot of ball together. They're confident in what they do, and they're very talented. Williams thrown down by the jersey, Reese Taylor. Be alert for maybe a shot to the end zone when it's second and one. You kind of, it's dealer's choice with the play call. Instead, Williams, and that'll move the chains to the 20-yard line. Williams up the middle. Did he get there? No. Second and goal. Williams again, hammerheads into the end zone, and Minnesota a PAT from tying it up. The second half for Minnesota, that's the brand of football they want to play. Move the ball down the field. The screen to Williams. And a nice pickup to set up a third and one. That's the brand of football they play. They want to possess it. They want to control the clock. On third and one, a first down for Williams. Sanusi Kane had to leave the game on that last play. His helmet had come off. Yeah, it just seemed like you were handing the team points when you didn't need to. Punt that football away, play field position. Tanner Morgan. Sets up the screen to Potts, shed the initial tackle, and then dropped by big number 90, Lawrence Johnson. This is now taking Minnesota out of its element. Pressure from Jenkins. Williams out of the backfield, and he gets out of bounds inside the 45 of Purdue. And at least keep some semblance of balance so Manny Diaz can't tee off. Second and nine. Here's Williams out of the backfield. And it's a good play out to the 45-yard line for Bryce Williams, cut down by Jair Brown. Come sit ringside. We'll do a little Formula 1-2. Now we're talking. Bryce Williams gets the carry here. Final minute of this game. Minnesota 4-4 on third down today. This is third and 10. Morgan pressure got away and finds Williams. Bryce Williams cuts back, and he's going to surge near the line to gain. Mr. Potts. On first down, this is Bryce Williams. Let's get an update on Gavin Winston from Rick Peace. Do run it, and it's Williams. Touchdown, Minnesota. From the Badgers, 21. This time it's Bryce Williams. Williams inside the 10. Another first down. From Minnesota, Daryl Peterson makes the stop. Span Ford is third from the bottom, number 88, the big tight end. Yep. Out of the backfield, and the catch is made by Williams. It is a catch. It'll be a first down for Minnesota. And they'll hand it off straight ahead, and it's Williams. He sidestepped the first defender and picks up four yards. Omar Brown for the Gophers, and they'll run it. Williams. Last three possessions, three and out, a pick, and a three and out for the Gophers. Second and five. Near side. Ball caught. Bryce Williams. 
Kelly McManus in the gun. They run it looking for the first. I don't know. Flag on the play. Looks like a face mask. Kelly McManus drops it off. Another completion out of bounds at the 30. And dealing with a third and six situation. Kelly McManus again, some time to throw. Only one incomplete. First down pickup. And Bryce Williams handing it to the Gophers, plus 15 on that play. Bryce Williams now gets the handoff and fighting for some tough yards. Kelly McManus to Bryce Williams, pushing his way right up the gut. Xander Mueller ends it. Kramer feeds Bryce Williams. He has a Minnesota first down into Louisiana territory. They may feel differently when they review that one when the game's over. Second down, Bryce Williams lowers the shoulder into Edwards. Williams in there, touchdown, Minnesota. Bunch of guys to one side of the line of scrimmage, which a lot of times gets a defense over leveraged. Bryce Williams reads it perfectly. Said, hey, Coach Fleck, where can I find a, a good Cajun meal? And there is one in a diner nearby suburb, Mr. Paul. So Jack found Mr. Paul's, and he's happy up here in the Twin City. Second and seven for Minnesota out of the timeout from the Louisiana 49. Bryce Williams inside the 45 to the 44. And a first down for Minnesota. That's their bread and butter. Louisiana out of timeouts. Williams. Close to the 30-yard line. With Darius Taylor out of the lineup. Williams puts this one away. So right back to it, just 12 seconds into this first quarter, already down 7-0 with Bryce Williams in the backfield. And they do hand it to him. Williams running hard, and he gains seven. The read option, Kelly Manish just hands it off. Williams is engulfed after a gain of about three. Kelly Manish feeling the pressure, and he finds his target on the run. It's Williams for a first down. Handoff, Williams barrels forward for the first down. Powerful run. Apologies for any technical issues here. As Minnesota set up for a second and long 10. Williams on the handoff. Stutter step move. Patient run and then power at the end to bring up third and short. And it Williams. So again, another first down. Another fourth down carry. Now they're going to have to get to the line quickly and spike it. Now, yeah. No timeouts. They're going to clock it. 